writing a ton of great stuff and I could uh, listen to his demo ideas and listen to his riffs and I knew instantly like if something would hit me and I, or I or I was you know um, uh, throwing ideas out there lyrically over something uh, just vibing off one of his ideas I would pick up my guitar or you know he gave me an awesome signature bass of his you know I, I would I'll even occasionally attempt a bass line and so um, if I if it's not hitting me if I don't have a great riff to accompany one of his or if I don't have a song like fully arranged uh, I didn't want to book the studio and then have um, you know a whole day of working on one song I just kind of wanted to make sure that the vocal idea was there and have some focus tracks and then once the focus tracks uh, started to become like um, in the walls and seven enemies and then we had uh, uh, AD and then we were working on uh, serve your masters and then uh, from Grace We Fallen came together quick. Those were kind of like the focus tracks, and then I was able to revisit some other stuff that I had written, like um, uh, Looking Down the Barrel of Today. I, I had that in the can, and uh, I kept explaining kind of my idea to Wayne, and like Wayne was, you know, like, dude, that's good. We should, we should, you know, try to work on that some more. And then uh, he came in and, and tracked a couple riffs for that, and then. Um, you know, once uh, Matt came in and put the drums down, we were like, wow, this one could make the record as well. So this, you know, this record, it just, it wasn't like we all got in the room at the same time and ran through everything. But, you know, we did make sure that we all got in the room to demo everything out once we had the basic ideas. And then we were able to live with those demos for a while so that, you know, you're happy about it. And so like Matt's like, you know what, I didn't like this way I played this beat, you you know, that's good. You live the demo for two or three weeks, so you can try a different beat. Like he came in on something's off and he put this halftime beat when we come back into the uh, chorus from the bridge and we were like, dude, that's killer. So like certain ideas showed themselves later in the process. And I think that's why it, it was important for us to, you know, to have me and Chris put all our ideas together and then just choose from the best ones, the ones that were really hitting hard. It's, it's time to this game. 